What's up guys and welcome back to another video and today as you can tell by the title we are going to be doing championship predictions for Tuesday night and yes um, I might be doing one for Wednesday night as well so yeah I hope you enjoy this video don't forget to like and subscribe yeah let's get straight into the video right so starting off with Birmingham v Blackburn this is going to be a tough one to predict but I'd probably say that because Birmingham are at home and Blackburn are doing okay this season. They do 2 2 at town against town. I'm not sure how Birmingham have been doing. I knew that we beat them at home 3 2. So I'm going to go for a 2 1 Birmingham win for this one. And now Millwall v Cardiff. Millwall are very strong at the den, their home. And Cardiff travelling away. Um, be very tough for them. So I think I'm going to go for a 1-1 draw in that one. Tied for Millwall, 1-1. Right then, so Preston v Leeds, as you can tell. Um, Leeds are starting well, Preston starting well. Two good teams going into this fixture. Preston are at home, Leeds are away. Um, this could go either way, really. Um, I can't see it being a draw. Um, but... Not being biased or anything, I think I'm gonna go. Um, I don't know, you know. This is a tough one. Um, I think I'm gonna go for a. I know I said not a draw, but I think it, after thinking about it, I think it's gonna be a 2 2 draw. So a 2 2 draw for that one, and I think for Leeds. Um, I think Alioski and Bamford will score. And then for Preston, I think Gallagher and Brown will score. So, yeah, that's my score prediction for that. And now QPR v Reading. Both of these teams aren't doing that. No, QPR are doing well. well Reading aren't. So, I think there's, there's not anything to do on this one. It's just an easy prediction. It's like, it's just, I think it's, I would say, like, 90% sure that QPR are going to win this. But it could go either way. But I think after the table and like the league games, I think I'm gonna go for a QPR 2 0 win. And they're at home as well. So now Sheffield Wednesday v Stoke. This is a tough one as well. Stoke are c c coming back um, after their bad start, and Sheffield Wednesday are doing well as well. I think they're in about a ninth. So yeah, I think. Because of the home advantage of Sheffield Wednesday, I think I'm going to go for a 3-1 um, Wednesday win, I'm going to go. And now moving on to Swansea City versus Brentford. Swansea are doing really well this season, but Brentford aren't doing as well. Um, beating 3-0 Derby, which wasn't good for me, so obviously I'm a Derby fan. But yeah, um, I can see Sw Swansea winning this, but I can see Brentford scoring. So I'm going for the same result as I predicted for Sheffield Wednesday to be stuck because the Swans have the home advantage and Brentford don't do that well away from home. So I think I'm going to go for a 2 3 1 Swansea win. Now I think this is the last game. Here it is. Last game is West Brom v Barnsley. Barnsley, um, they're not doing that well in the season. West Brom are doing really well. Um, top of the league, I think West Brom are. Barnsley are about. I think they're about 20th or 21st or I know that they're either in the the in the bottom five teams um, at the bottom of the league. So yeah, um, for this one, it's going to be tough um, for Barnsley tonight. Um, but I think it's going to be a 3-0 West Brom win. 3-0 West Brom. And yeah, moving on um, to... A th should I do Wednesdays? No, I'll do I'll do a different video for that. So yeah guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And yeah, I will see you next time. Bye.